Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and I have a Dollar Tree haul for you and some iced coffee. So if you saw my video Monday, I went and found the trolls in Dayton, Ohio. And on my way there, I found a Dollar Tree. And I always like to go to out of town stores. So most of the stuff is from a store in Dayton, Ohio. Sorry, my hair's a little crazy. I went for a bike ride today. Um, I found some fun stuff. So let's get started. First thing I found was this is um, Global Beauty Gummy Bear Exfoliating like Body Scrub. It's the Gummy Bear. I know they came out last year with the um, Lip Scrub, but I think this is more of a body scrub, which I'm excited for. Um, because it's summer and you need to exfoliate. I'm gonna do a nice pedicure and do my legs. And you get a decent amount in here. And it's gummy bear flavor scented. I also found Spa Essentials Dew is the name of it. It's Hyaluronic Acid Serum. Hydrate and Restore. I'm not sure what this brand is. Maybe you know. It's not a Dollar Tree brand, I know that. And it's just, you know, basic hyaluronic acid, which I use every single day. So I thought that was fun to try. Why not, right? Something new, something different. Um, I saw these first there, and then when I was at my Dollar Tree today, I actually saw them at mine. But these are, I wanna open this up. Antibacterial hand wipes, wild berry. Ah, there we go. And it just seems fun. I like to keep these on hand, especially in my car. Which, speaking of, I need to go wash that. Okay, or not. I'm de tempted to use my teeth, but I really don't want to do that. Ah, scissors. Scissors. That smells good. The other scent was more flowery, and I'm not really a big, unless it's real flowers, I'm not really a big floral scent kind of gal. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. Um, I just like to have these on hand in my car, because, you know, cold, flu, norovirus. Ain't nobody got time for norovirus. I don't think that would fit in my cup holder, but it's okay and they smell delicious. Um, benzo chloride. I'm wondering if this is good on the flu because it's more than just alcohol. The norovirus alcohol doesn't kill it. But anyway, these are fun. All back to say they smell good and they're fun. Um, there was some repeat stuff from last school season. I grabbed this notebook because I love a notebook. And I do keep notebooks on hand to write down ideas for videos and stuff. And I thought this was just fun. It's just a lined notebook, but it has a little cover and a little pen holder and I would keep it in my purse. And then if I come up with any ideas for a video, I could just, and then it has a little thing that tells me what page I'm on. Yeah, I don't necessarily like this pen. It's stuck. It's not a good pen, just for the record. But it, this thing will hold regular other pens. So just a little notebook to keep in my car or in my purse. Let's get this trash moving. Oh, here. I decided to bring a container. Um, I grabbed one of these. I love these for travel. Um, now, especially being as my YouTube channel is considered me being self-employed, I do have to keep certain receipts and stuff. And this is just great for that. Because you can put documents in here. And then up front, there's another little compartment. And these are great. They come out with these, you know, several times a year. But I grab one or two just to have on hand. And same thing with the little stationary kits. Um, I like last year's better, not gonna lie, but uh, this one has just some, and this might be the same from last year, floral 
you get a couple pieces of stationery, envelope, and a thank you card. And I do like mailing on occasion. I like mailing out actual cards. So I grabbed one of those. Now, these were all the rage last year. They're clear sticky notes and then you use a Sharpie to write on them. And so you can use them to like anecdote or highlight or leave yourself messages. But this year they came out with fun colors. So they had pink, purple, there was an orange, a blue. You get a hundred and they're transparent. So if you wanna write in a book, but you don't really wanna write in a book, perfect for studying or whatever. Also good for planners. So I grabbed two of these, because why wouldn't I? Why wouldn't I? Um, yes, okay. For tr car travel, I love this little size. They're not cost effective as the bigger ones, but they're very convenient to have on hand. Um, I do try to keep the little paper cover. So if I throw them in my purse, I can just put the paper cover back on. But these are great lint rollers if you have pets, such as myself. I have cats and let me show you. And those cats fur comes with me. They're also good for my cross stitches. So they're just a little roll. You get 40, 40 sheets. Just, just enough to keep on hand in your purse, travel, whatever. Those are great. And then I picked up these for my some bags, some goodie bags. I had found these once before, one time, and I have been on the hunt. So when I saw a three pack, a three packs, I said, I need them. And they're just faux wax stickers, but you can put them on the back of cards or seal little goodie bags or something. And they're just kind of fancy schmancy. Um, yeah, and they had pink, but those look more Valentine-y and these, I like the colors of these. So I grabbed a three pack. I will put these in with my gift giving stuff. And for $1.25, you can't really beat that. In my eyes anyway. Um, oh, one more bag from that store. These I'm taking to work. Um, they're just coffee cups with a lid, but I have a coffee bar at my office and sometimes we forget cups or we want something like a hot tea, but we didn't bring a cup. So I just like to have them there in case anybody needs a coffee or a cup. And there are four ounce, four cups and they're 16 ounces each. Should this be our thumbnail? Cause they're pretty. Let's do this. That's a good thumbnail. So I'll bring these in to work tomorrow. Cause that's what we do. That's what we do. Oh, I grabbed this. I must have been hungry, but I didn't eat it. I get these all the time. They're just little meat and cheese sticks. I found this because I think I lost my other one to make a wreath of some sort. I don't know. We'll make something out of it. Just a wooden circle. Also, I've had these before, and they're a lot of fun to make little miniature signs on. You can paint them or do whatever, but I like the, um, the size of that just in the wood section. I've had that before. Okay, and then the last two items I purchased, this is for um, my trip. I'm gonna put it in my bag to do a face mask on the airplane because I'll be on the airplane for like eight hours. And it's very dry on an airplane. And this is a blueberry mask and it says um, highly nourishing essence map mask with fresh superfood extracts, moisturizing, nourishing, revitalizing, and soothing. So I thought this would be perfect. It's probably purple, so we'll do it in the middle of the night when everybody's sleeping. So I grabbed that to go on my vacation um, because if you've not flown, airplanes are very dry and you should always wear sunblock because they do have UV rays in the plane, but irrelevant. Airplanes are dry, and if you're on an airplane for more than five hours, that's considered a long haul flight, and you really want to hydrate, and I bring moisturizers. I just get very dry. Anywho, and then this was something I had not seen before, but they're little flower. So you make like a floral out of felt, and it has the directions on the back. I think this makes like one, maybe two. I don't really know how many it makes, to be fair. 
so we'll figure it out. But I think, I mean, it kind of acts like it makes all of those, but it doesn't seem like that's enough to make all of those. But what do I know? We're going to try it because I think it'll be fun and I love greenery. So that was everything from the Dayton store. And then, I, like I said, I ran to my Dollar Tree this morning just to see, and I did find some stuff. I think some of you have seen these before, but this is the first time they had them at my store. And I'm so excited that I bought two, one for me. Actually, I bought three for me. One for me, 42 ounces. It tells you when to drink, but honestly, for me, it's just a measure it of how much liquids I'm getting during the day. I try to hydrate, guys, but I love me some coffee. Then I got one to give away to my team, and then I got one to put by our coffee maker so I can bring water, and then you just fill the coffee maker with this water. And I thought it was a good measure for that as well. Um, but you get all of your times, but on the back you get, you start off at 42 ounces and it tells you how many ounces. Up here you get um, just like a water drinker thing. And honestly, when I go to Pelotonia and ride my bike, I might put this full of water in the back because I think I'm getting a, so I'm waiting for Amazon. I ordered a bag for my bike, a bigger bag. So this would fit in there. I don't know, you have to have water. It was $1.25, friends. Oh wait, this may should be my thumbnail. Cause hers big. It's big. So I grabbed that. Oh, and then I grabbed two for Sarah because I called her and said, girl, you need one of these? And she said, yeah, I do. Um, when I went in, there was some clearance. So I grabbed another two sets of these. These are the star candy little holders, but I'm going to use them, I think, at least the red and silver and maybe the blue for Christmas and put candy in it for like little gift things. Um, because stars are Christmas. Yeah. And you get four in each and they're all different sizes, but that's okay. We'll see. So I got those half price. So I thought that was a good thing. Um, I got this for myself because it's a coffee pen. I mean, duh. If you know me, you know that this is a must-have. Um, for travel, I grabbed two packs of these glasses cleaners. Um, I just throw, I like that they're individually packaged. I throw them in my carry-on bag. I keep them with me when I'm out touring because nothing drives me more nuts than to have um, goop or sunblock or something on my glasses. And when I make the goodie bags for my family, I will add these a couple to each of them as well. So there's 24 of them here. I don't need all of them. I'll throw, leave some at home. Also, I will bring some when I ride my bike because again, sweat, sunblock, glasses, makes me nuts. But I'll give everybody a couple just to have because we all wear glasses. And then the last thing I got, um, this is gonna be some stocking stuffers. I found Ohio State magnets. Now I've seen these, these are like the ceramic ones. I've seen these for the Bengals. I've seen them for Cleveland Browns, but I've never seen the Ohio State Buckeyes. And I found three at my one store. And so these will be like stocking gifts for Christmas for a couple family members. Uh, my brother and his wife are from here, but they live in North, South, Myrtle Beach, South Carolina, South Carolina. I will definitely be giving them in their package one of these magnets for their refrigerator. Um, so I always try to grab it when I see like Ohio State stuff because it's very expensive. Even though I live here, it's expensive. So that is everything I got at the Dollar Tree this week. I have lots of videos up. Friday's video, you haven't seen it yet, but it's a bicycle and it's an electric bicycle, not a trike, a bike. And I am loving it. It is performing well beyond my expectation. The only thing that can make it better for me is if it wasn't so darn heavy to get it into my car to go places. But today I rode it 10 miles and it was wonderful. Just have to make sure your battery's charged because nobody needs to get stuck with a hundred pound bike miles from home. I will just throw that out there. But that's everything, guys. I hope you enjoy and that you're having a fantastic day and I will talk with you later. Bye.